Hey, what's up? I'm Emily, and I'm catching up on what I'm doing right now. Today is mostly going to be working on a project for a company called Macmillan. I will fill you in on the details regarding that later. I forgot to mention that I also have to film some SciShow today. So I'm on my way to Complexly now. Gonna get a few episodes out of the way, then back to cinema. Didn't get no soggy feet, so... <laughs> okay. Okay, where does it go there? Okay. SciShow has upgraded uh, from the little lav mic to the Sennheiser MKH-50. Dang. So this is the first shoot with this mic? Nah. Nah? <laughs> Why wasn't it plugged in then? Who was it plugged in? Well, oh, we got a new cable today, so oh. we can run it. Not across the middle of the room. Oh. All right, is it pointing at your mouth or no. what? No. Geobacter metal reducens. All right, SciShow's done. It took a little longer than I expected, which I think means I'm gonna have less time than I expected to work on the Macmillan project. And I still wanna make it to the gym tonight, so I can't spend all night working on the Macmillan thing, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. We just finished our first meeting of 2018. Yay! 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 This is gonna be the last thing shot on the uh, Panasonic GH5 because now I have to pack it up and send it back. Uh, right, so Logan? Pack it up, 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 pack it up. Something. Yeah, right. All right, I'm back at the gym. I have to run at least three miles today. It shouldn't be too bad. I'm also supposed to lift today and see how I feel after I finish jogging. I didn't think I was going to have the energy to do it, but I somehow managed to run three miles and still muster the power to lift weights afterwards. I feel very dead right now. I feel like I've exerted myself to 99% of my possible energy output for the day. I was saving that 1% for walking into and out of Walmart. <laughs> I think I drank too much water after I finished working out because it, it feels like it's sloshing up into my esophagus, especially because the road is all snowy right now, the car is bumpy and I can feel it. Ooh. It's not good, Kelsey. It's no good. But I am proud of myself for pushing through. Right, Kelsey? Oh. Right. Oh. I've been getting these Atkins bars for years, the peanut butter granola bars. It looks like they have a new version, peanut butter granola bar. But if you look, this one has one more net carb, one extra gram of protein. They changed the formula. 10 more calories. I don't mind particularly. I'm more just curious why the change, what motivated it. And I guess I'm also curious if this will taste any different. I'm telling you, I really pushed it to the limit today at the gym. I'm like borderline passing out in the Atkins aisle of Walmart right now. I'm not actually gonna pass out. The problem that I'm having right now is that I drank so much water at the gym after I finished working out. And my stomach feels so full. I'm sure if I tried to eat anything, I would just puke it right up. We could call Gory and we could say, puke on aisle uh, 23. Is that what aisle we're on? There's no numbers on the aisles. Oh, I see here we have some Child Wren's Nutrit Ionals, some Calc Iam and Mine Rowls, some Herb Al Speci Alti Supplements. Whoop. All right, I'm going to bed. I gotta get up early so I can film a freaking, what's it called, Crash Course Film Criticism. I mean, I should go to bed anyway because I'm trying to get to bed earlier in general. I'm just, I'm still really tired. Hopefully that means falling asleep won't be very difficult tonight. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.